Hey everyone, and welcome back to Mutant Year Zero. Just a reminder, today is the launch day. So if you haven't already picked the game up and you want it, you can grab it on Steam, or if you want so you can help support the channel by using the link in the description down below. But with that said, we've got to get ourselves out of quite the sticky situation here. We're about to activate a bunch of guys, and it's not going to be fun. Um, I'm not quite sure what to do about it. Other than we can fall back here and take a 75% and hope for a disable and hope they don't hear us. I could also fall over here someplace and hope they don't hear us. That seems unlikely. 75, 50, nah. Actually, here's as good as any place. 75%. Let's go for it. Borman, get on in. He does have a disable on his um, gun, so there's some some chance. We'd have to hit the 75, then we got to hit a 30, I think it is. And then they, also we have to have the other guy not hear us. It's a tall order, but it's all we can do. Nope. Didn't get it. Uh, and this guy's now looking at... They're both looking at us, so I assume they know what's going on then. And they're going to be coming over here. Now, Barrow has great crit chance. If we move, we're going to be spotted, it looks like. It looks like everywhere we go, she gets spotted. Hmm. Well, if we fire from here, she's only got a 50. Let's, let's just move up here. Yeah, she loses her spot, which means she lost all of her crit. She would have had a 100% chance to crit, but we, wouldn't, we weren't going to kill this guy regardless. And I'll we'll look at ducks over there. I want it to be closer. And this is all we can really do. Oh, she had a disable as well. I forgot about that. Well, that helps a little bit. This guy's flying into the air like you just don't care. Don't kill us. Oh, nice. He goes on Overwatch. Whoa. And that guy takes a shot at Pharaoh and almost pulls it off. Well, then. This is where I wish I had some grenades. Should have really, and I mean really, have loaded them up before this. I could pull the Overwatch with Borman. If we get a kill, Borman gets Twitch Shot and he gets Hog Rush. He can't use Hog Rush, I don't think. Because there's no way up. Well, the way up there is over there. This guy's too far. We could move into the open and shoot after pulling the Overwatch by running out. And then we could shoot. We can't even shoot twice because he's got the Gapper and he's got to shoot up into the air too. That's terrible. We could move here. We have line of sight there. Nope, no line of fire. We could elevate and hope to sh to disable out of range. Nope, that's not good. Well, maybe, actually. Maybe, because you can fly a couple tiles away with this. Can we go two tiles? Oh, yeah, we can. We can go here and have a 50%. To hit him, and then maybe it's like a, I think a 30, or was it 50% chance to disable? That's a 25% chance of working, all things considered. I don't see that really panning out in our favor. Ooh, she gets the circuit breaker, but that doesn't help us. Actually, that might help us, because we could then move over here, then elevate, then disable this one. So that's the ticket. But to get that up, we need to get a kill over here. And to, and then we're going to have to pull the Overwatch with Borman. Which means, I think, he's got 9 hit points. We have to hit for 10. That's going to be pretty rough, actually. Unless we get a crit, which is a 30% chance. There's no way to increase that. Well, let's pray for luck, ducks. Pray for a lucky ducky. That had to hurt. Yeah, but it didn't hurt the way we needed to. Okay, this is very bad. But there's really only one way to do it. If we move here, we go to 70. We need to cut that down to 100. All right. Borneman's got to pull this overwatch, which is going to be painful. Get this kill and then stand in the open against that one. Oh. Hits for eight. Emergency assistance. 
Well. Oh, I just saw the, his head fly outside the, the realm there. So this is perfect. You can come over here and get cover, fly up over there for a flank, negate his elevation bonus with Pharaoh, and then disable him with the crossbow. Which, what are the sh well, if he's disabled, we don't necessarily have to worry about it too much. Uh, we could maybe move even closer here for a little bit of range bonus. Yeah, let's do that. Now, I think we're going to be too short. Oh, we could fly a couple tiles closer, actually, with this, now that I think about it. One, two, maybe we can even get elevation on him. You can only go, oh, wait a minute. You can only, only go one tile up. 75% to crit. Okay. It's going to be 50-50. This is bad. <laughs> Still, though... Actually, no, it's a 75%. Range? Hold on. What if we switch to the crossbow? 100%. Circuit Breaker's gonna drop it down to 75. As long as we can hit this, this guy's disabled. For the love of God, Pharaoh, save us, key all-star MVP! <laughs> what a combo that was. Borman's gonna take a big hit. Oh, actually, no, he somehow got missed. Hold us, but we don't have a huge amount of time to deal with. So, ducks could come over here and I think we get a step out flank from there, but I'm not sure. But he also would have to reload. I think we're honestly better off ignoring him for now and using this opportunity to get into cover. Maybe we'll shoot the other one a couple of times here. 50%? Sure. Oh, well. At least we're all alive. Which is great. This guy can jump in the air, though. I don't think he can jump into the building. Being inside of buildings is very helpful. Against robots, it seems. 75 here with the memer. Ooh. See that every day from Borman. Nice work, buddy. I think that guy's going to be undisabled, like, right now. So... Our only bet is to fly in here. All right, we've got all 75% cover in the building. He had to reload. This one was actually still disabled. I guess the one is how many more turns. This guy went on Overwatch. Let's come over here, reload with ducks. Get a nice big shot into his face, ducks. Nice big shot. Yeah, I did that. Nice. What do you think about that, huh? Knockdown too. That got rid of his Overwatch. Very nice. And because he no longer has the overwatch, we can get closer here with Borman. Spread out a little bit in case they have some kind of grenade I don't know about. And we're gonna have to go for another pistol shot, but hey, 75% with the memer, Borman. Woo! Double 5% crits with Borman. Do we, we're out of ammo on the crossbow, so if we do move over here, we can't do very much. But I'm going to do it anyway with Pharaoh to get her in position. Looks, looked like she was hidden there for a minute. Oh, if she's hidden, she gets bonus crit, which means if I keep her out of... I guess that's just direct line of sight. So if she had like a long-range sniper, she'd be critting left and right. This isn't something we can do, but we can overwatch in case the other guy flies over near us. Oh, or that happens. Oh, well. Overwatch again. Overwatch again. Now, this guy over here is about to get wrecked by Borman. They don't even know. Pump the reload. Uh, we hit for eight. He's got eight. Uh, yeah, eight with the armor. So, perfect. That's 100% on the ground, buddy. Thanks for playing. Now, ducks, does, can he see you? If I move in here, will he be able to shoot? I think he actually will, and I don't want to find out the hard way. So we're just going to overwatch instead. Overwatch. Overwatch. 
damage. I think he's got a 50-50 to shoot us from there. Ah, uh, but when he comes down, we're in a much better position. And he had to dash to get over there to do that. Okay. Now we're talking. Let's get rid of his armor, or his wall, rather, and let's also charge him. Get out of our get out of our house. Beautiful. Holy. This game is just unbelievable. I have serious difficulty believing how awesome it is. It's simplistic yet beautiful. 100% 20 crit EMP. It's Pharaoh. What do you think about that? <laughs> we actually knocked him up. He got so shocked, he's stunned and shocked. Ducks, come on up, buddy. In the face. <laughs> Didn't knock him back down. <laughs> we knocked him down, stood him up, and knocked him back down again. Oh, boy. Well. That worked. I was actually really worried. Now. Before I make another huge misplay. Let's come in here and re-equip our grenades for the love of God. I have so many of these disabled grenades. That would have been just a joke if I had been using them. Uh, you know, I do like a smoke just to... Oh, wait, this is slot number one. Let's do that. Uh, smoke over there. I just forget to re-equip them. I just assume, like, they'd automatically refill, but they don't. So, this is probably good. We got... Triple EMP. I don't think this is of any use. Go for smoke. A, a regular um, burn nation. I'm not even sure if they're flammable. So we get some levels up here. Borman, what do we want to do with you? Well, we could go for health. Or we could unlock stone skin. Invincibility would be interesting, but we'd have to give up hog rush. Hmm. I guess it gives us options, right? So let's do that. Even if we don't use it. In fact, it'd be very useful right now. Because we could pop that and then run an overwatch, actually. Corpse Eater wouldn't be bad for Pharaoh sometimes. We'd have to give up her flying. But the ability to heal her every once in a while wouldn't be bad. I don't think we're going to use Frog Legs or the other one, so... Or we could push down here. It's going to be a lot of points. Let's go for the Corpse Eater. So we can occasionally heal her as necessary. Let's go back to Borman for a minute and actually switch to Invincible. I think that's a good idea for this, because these guys like to jump into Overwatch positions with elevation, and that's pretty it's pretty difficult to deal with. What is making all this beeping? Ooh, that was another EMP grenade, too. Random robot scrap. There is a guy we could probably kill by his onesies. If a loved one is experiencing symptoms, report them to the nearest police box. I gotta go. I gotta go. Uh, I was trying to do the right thing, but it wasn't working out right. All right, so he sees us. Pharaoh, actually, let's activate with her because she does a ton of damage. Yeah, 100% chance to crit when she's not visible. Now, according to this, I can move there and not be visible. Move here and it's still 50. Move here and we get spotted and it's still 50. So I don't think we're going to get any better than we have. We could just take a shot. This is a huge one and that's a little one. Is there any chance we could disable him? Chance to ignite is our special over there. The shotgun has 50% chance of EMP. If I put that on a silent weapon, that would have been cool. But that's not what we have. So let's go to ducks. He does have the disable here. Okay. To use it, we'd have to go to the pistol. We get a 75 because of range. We're going to have to move up to eliminate that. I want to make sure that we are out of range of the other one. Yep, right here. Let's give it a whirl and see if it uh, works for us. Circuit breaker on the pistol, silent 75%. <laughs> Second time. Second time. Okay, I'm just gonna go loud. Foreman, get out there. I know this guy's coming over now. 
This is where I actually want to knock him down, but unfortunately we can't. However, we could twitch shot him, or we could go stone skin. Does that end the turn? No, it just makes us immune and vulnerable for one turn. This would be a great time for him, for him to shoot us. All right. You got some iron skin. And then let's go for a bit of the old double EMP disable. If we get some luck. 75% gaper in the face. Ooh, literally, literally in the face. Second one missed, though, unfortunately. Because the first one, he got knocked back. Uh, and now... What's our shotgun chance? From here it's 75, from here it's 50. Here is cover relative to the other one. Really hoping we get a disable right now. 50-50, basically. Beautiful. There we go. Shooting, he actually missed on Borman. There goes our shield, but hey, that's fine. Um, we could disable that one and lay into some damage on this one. This one's going to be disabled for one more turn. Best person to do that, Foreman can reload. And let's have him throw out the EMP over here on that guy. Now, I wonder if they're both disabled if we're stealth. Or if we're hidden, rather. If that's the case, Pharaoh's gonna hit like a truck. Nope, she's not hidden. I'm the hero, you're the zero. Yes! Wow. Wow, she did disable it. It went from one to two. Finger. Nice. She's being really helpful on this one. Awesome. Now, it went from three to two, so we got a little bit of time here. 75. It's going to be 75 no matter what. Let's get Borman up. We gave her to the face and then bumped him right onto the ground. And back up he gets, even though he's still stunned. Robots are all about the disabled. Give up now and I'll go easy on ya. That's right. All right, she's got to reload, so we're going to risk another 75 here. You don't here. know who you're messing with. Wow. <laughs> they really don't know who they're messing with. Okay. Regroup now. Let's, uh, I did use a grenade there. Let's make sure we redo it. I wish, I really wish, um, they would add an automatic refilling of grenades if you have, if you use one. Just, you know, and you have one, just fill it back up. That'd be really cool. Like a quality of life thing. Ooh. Yeah, broken electronics. Sometimes they're really hard for me to see. See those ruins over there? That's the Forbidden City. I don't know why they call it the Forbidden City. I've been scared to go near it. Oh, I wonder why they do call it that. Can we see on the map? I think that means over here. Yeah, that's a, that must be the Forbidden City, but this is where we want to go, which is the opposite direction right now. Is this the, this is where I can use the key? Oops. <laughs> Never made that mistake going into a store before. Look at this quarantine, friends. Medkit? Your... Why does it sound like there's something disabled over there? I keep hearing it. Oh, there are the, um, the flutterbys over there. Like dragonflies or whatever. Welcome. Is that really all there was Welcome in here? Was one med kit? I got a key. Yeah. Unless I'm blind, which I'm sure I'll never hear the end of it in the comments. If I am missing something. 
But I guess there was just one medkit there. All right. Well, we want to go over here now. Unfortunately, I got to walk all the way over there, so we'll just do like a quick edit. Actually, you know what? Before we do that, let's unlock this zone so we don't have to come back here and walk through it because we're right here. There might be a little cutscene or something. Who knows? Well, that's purple. Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. The Castle of Light. All right, now I'm just going to walk across the whole zone. I'll check for a loot on my way over and just cut the whole thing out. Because... Oh, wow. So we got a bird with a hat, a temple, and then something else after this. Okay. A few people from our settlement came this far south once. They just didn't come back. Some they say their bodies were turned into plants and eaten by evil wizards. This place gives me the creeps. Hmm. I would kind of want to switch to Corpse Eater on everyone to get back to full. Wow, it's just a nice little field of grass over there with nothing in it. But before I do that, I want to see if there's robots here or humans or... I mean, obviously, if there's robots, there's no point. Super foggy. Oh, here's something. Ooh, nice. Ooh, nice. Broken gun out there behind the shed. Oh, oh, there we go. Yep, that is indeed a human. So here's the plan. I think it's this one. Yeah, let's switch the wings over to Corpse Eater on her. Do the same deal over here on Borman. And then let's see how what level. Oh, there's actually two of them up there. One of them is a pyro, sect butcher. 14 hit points. That won't be a problem. Pyro will be a bigger Blessed problem. Be oh, no. Use my body as your vehicle for vengeance. Find the thief among us. Strike him down. Not another one of those guys. I want to party, man. I don't want to work for the Noah sect. Why are we doing this? That's what you say. The agents are watching us, you blank. So shut up. Get back to work. Yes, I was hoping that if he did that, these guys would split up. Perfect. Hey, buddy. You made the wrong move. If you get near him, a lot of times they'll have a little conversation. Get in a fight, and then you can do some stealths. I am the beautiful weapon. Problem is, from me. <laughs> whoops. Problem is, I can't uh, eat the single guy's corpse. <laughs> Group. You guys coming? Yeah. All right. Some I'm... ghouls up ahead, guarding the entrance to the farm. Time for hunter mode. Now you're telling us that like it's some kind of lesson. We can probably just evaporate this guy. I don't think there's anyone else here. Just get really close and have a fun time. shoot him like right in the back he does have elevation which i didn't think about until maybe i should have snuck over there to run up uh is there any chance to knock him off with borman yeah there's always a chance also with the sniper rifle all right let's, let's have ducks do it on the slinger actually 50 percent above end range all right ducks 75 percent if you walk out here you're not gonna get any better than that buddy 75 percent ducks Knock them off, please. Yeah, it's getting fun. Nope. The 
boomstick disables, so at this point I get close with Borman. We can take two fifties, or we can see what we can do here with Pharaoh, which is nothing. Just move up. He's going to throw a fire on both of us. Split up a little bit. 75% for nine. I'll get some. Okay, Borman, we're just gonna take a single shot here. Hopefully, 75. Yeah, that was awesome. It was. It was really awesome. Come on. All right. Oh, nice. Maltov. That could actually be useful. So, since we're no longer fighting robots here, let's get rid of these things. Let's actually bring out some Molotovs. Borman's actually probably better with a chem flare, to be honest, for support uh, and a Molotov. Or even a regular grenade. Even though ducks can throw it further, I like him having the smoke and a Molotov. Makes a lot of sense. And then on Pharaoh, you can have the chem light and smoke. I don't even need the chem light. No, let's have Molotov, smoke. Foreman's got chem light grenade. Fantastic. Let's check our perks. Three available, nothing there, nothing here, nothing there. I'm going alone. Come on. Go check the outside of the farm first. Ooh, like a giant farm thing. I should, well, I have four med. I was going to say I should go to town and get more med kits, but. Apparently, I've been picking them up. And, ooh. Heavily armored. Steel teeth. Must have been some combat machine. <laughs> it's amazing. I wanted a cutscene, though, for the thumbnail. I get so excited for, like, easy thumbnails. Here's a road to... Where is that a road to? I'm gonna guess it's down to Birdland. The object Get this through your heads. The sacred mushrooms are not to be eaten. They can be used only for holy ritual. Oh. So I ate a mushroom. So what? <laughs> Brain boy's not going to find me. My skull's too thick. I told you to split it with me. Tell me what happened. Did you see the ancients? Hell no. I saw some purple. And the purple laughed at me, so I started laughing. Then I took a piss. That felt real good. So what's the big deal? Sacred mushrooms. Psh. Stupid Nova sect. Phonies! I think one of them is going to split up. I just wanted to make sure if they came towards me, I was ready. But they did split up, but that one went over there. You got a Hunter 24 and a Tank 30 hit points. I don't think they're going to be split up enough, but that was hilarious, though. It's like, the sacred mushrooms are not for you. He's like, so what? I ate a mushroom, <laughs> like, two seconds later. <laughs> uh, my skull is too thick. What is this fog of war, by the way? Am I going to stumble into somebody, or... Uh-oh. There ought to be a robot. There he is, over there by the farm. This appears to be the path. Yep, that's the objective. So... Let's see what this is. It frustrates me that the once compliant subjects have now become very intemperate and aggressive. Within degree, a sub-faction has developed, with Plutonia as the leader. Our hardships in the zone have convinced Plutonia that the world needs to be reset. These radical notions worry me. We are very close to the facility. Once we are safe, I'm confident that Plutonia and the others will become more manageable. Hmm. Okay, here's another hunter with another... There's a lot of guys here. That looks like a grenade on the bench. I'm not sure this is necessarily worth it. Looks like two big groups of guys. I do have invulnerability. We do have corpse eater. Actually, the corpse eater might make it worth it by itself. Whoever 
here steals mushrooms will be punished severely. Okay, I need to get near those guys. Let's see what they have to say about this. Ooh, look at all these mushrooms. Looks like they found the perfect fertilizer for these mushrooms. Dead bodies. Wow. Okay. That's great. Ooh, this is what I want. Elevation. So those three guys are over. If I get close to them, maybe I'll hear them talk and they'll split up. You have one job. Watch the robot. Where's the robot? I told you. I turned around and... Where's the robot? You want to get me to trouble, do you? Find the robot. Wow, there's a lot of guys. So there's a, um, a scion inside here. Three guys over here. Three guys over to the other side. That's a lot of fights. Potentially. I would like to take the shaman out silently. And it does look like we may have an opportunity to do that over here. Yeah, I like how I see the shadow. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, that's so weird. I can't see him. Oh. What the heck was I looking at? What was that shadow? What is going on? Oh, there's a giant windmill. That's cool. Okay, so this guy comes over here and stops. That's a great place to ambush him. Don't know if we're going to be able to take him out with 24 hit points silently. But we can try. Next time he comes back. Uh, don't even know if we need to do it silently. Honestly. Before we get into this, let me check my perks really quick. So Corpse Eater is not going to help us on this specific one. Wings could. I guess if you use one and it's on cooldown, you could just immediately switch over. Corpse Eater here is not going to help us. Iron Skin might actually stun will help a lot. And over here, this isn't going to help. But Knee Shot? Nah, that's not going to really matter at all. You can always wings for 100% crit anyway. Now we wait. For our barn ambush. Which is going to be in the next episode. So when's we returning? I take out this shaman. We take out the rest of this camp. And then we move on to find our uh, lost raider. But until then, thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Actually, no, it's a 75% range. Hold on. What if we switch to the crossbow? 100%. Circuit Breaker is going to drop it down to 75. As long as we can hit this, this guy's disabled. For the love of God, Pharaoh, save us. Key All-Star MVP. Woo! <laughs> what a combo that was.